yo, yo, you're watching the internet's most passionate family, that Reyes family, and in this video, Sarah holds it down in the kitchen, and we want to get you more involved with our videos. Enjoy. Hi guys, I'm so glad to be home and back in my routine. I am with my little belly boo this morning. Hi baby. Watch this. She's in her jammies. And now... <clears throat> Outfit of the day. Wow, Brittany, are you so glad to have Brittany back? Mm -hmm. I'm glad to be back. I know if I already said this, but I'm just so glad to be home. But I'm also so very glad that I got a chance to be with some of my closest friends this weekend. We left like Saturday at 6.30 in the morning and just literally spent every single hour with friends and family of mine. It was just so refreshing. Saturday we started out with my sister trying out wedding dresses um, with the girlfriends and then that night we had a birthday party dinner and then we went over to my friend Adriana's house and some of our uh, guy friends and girlfriends from like childhood were all there. Um, so it was just really good to be with people that we like, it was just really good for me to be with people that I like grew up with and I, we don't get to do that very often. It kind of only happens when my best friend comes to town, we just kind of make it a point to this is our time to be with our people, so I had so much and fun. And now, if you take out the pants. She has a t-shirt on. Uh -huh. And then Sunday, we woke up super early and went with my sister, my mom, and her, my sister's fiance to her wedding uh, venue food tasting, which was absolutely incredible. The food's going to be so good that day, no matter which plate they choose. What's up, y'all? I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> And then my sister found her wedding dress, and then Monday I kind of just spent the day with my best friend, and we traveled all the way back, and it's just good to be home, back in the routine. But look who's home! Hi! Um, hi everyone. <laughs> Come here, Bob, give me a hug, man. Um, he's probably home for lunch, right? Home for lunch? <sighs> but let me show you guys what I'm making for dinner first. Uh-oh, holla! So I'm making that uh, spaghetti squash recipe again. And if you saw a few vlogs back, um, we made the spaghetti squash and meatball recipe, and I have everything but the meatballs. So I just and I, but I do have chicken. So I made the sauce and spaghetti squash stuff in here, and then towards the end, I'll just add the chicken. So I'm excited for dinner tonight because last time we had this, it was super, super good. Shout out video. The shout out is to my two grandmas, Grandma Steli and Grandma Alva. Let's see the shout out video. So, the first shout out is to Grammy Steli. But this next one is for Grandma Awa. Okay guys, let's see the big shout out video. Okay, so what do you think is in these jammies? Comment down below. I think there's a teddy bear and some giraffe spots. Let's see. I was right. Look at that teddy bear. What do you think next shout out video is going to be like? Outside, inside, at a park. I'm not going to tell you. You're going to see. Next shout out video is going to be. <gasps> Guess what it's going to be? For my daddy. And I'm going to sing for my dad. I'm going to sing for my dad. I love you, dad. You're my thing. You and I am together. You are mine forever. Yo, what up? It's dinner time, and the mom hooked it up with some spaghetti squash. Well, that is a luxury I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> but still, like, it's good. So, mommy's tearing hers. I just mix it all up. Girls are having some sandwiches. Sandwiches? Sandwiches. Sandwiches? Not called sandwiches. What is it called? They refuse to get the, this stuff because it's too spicy. Yeah, this one's spicy, but 
We like it. I like it. I've been playing Call of Duty. This game is so hard, but it's super fun. And I gotta say this. I gotta say this in front of my wife. What? She's. I'm so lucky to have her as a wife because some wives might be tripping that their husband. I've leave. come a long way though. Sarah's come a long way. We. <laughs> I used to when I first when we first married, I think Sadie was about to be born or just born or something like that. Uh, we used to play this game on the computer, and I was mm -hmm. like so addicted to it, and like I had to break it one time just because it was so addicted to it. Um, and then I bought it again, had to break it again, and I bought it, and so got one and got old. But Sarah, I just gotta say, is like awesome wife that you know certain things that you know I do and that I like, and certain things she likes, and we're the type of parents and I guess um, married couple that like we don't trip, we don't trip. Well, I mean, we well, know. We know. You let me go for three whole days. Like, what? I was not here for well, three whole days and you held down the fort. Like, well, why would I complain about something so But it's no thing. It's no thing, you know? Like, hey, there's certain things where... Can I tell them something? Yes, what's up? So we first had Xbox number three, Xbox <laughs> number two, Xbox number one. <laughs> That's funny. So I did have the Xbox, it was just the Xbox, and then the three... I'd have a, I've had them all? I sure have, buddy. I, I ha bought you the first Xbox. Sarah bought me the first one for my birthday. I think we weren't even married yet. We were still dating. We had we're still dating. Yeah, so, so um, outside of reading blogs and reading all that kind of stuff, like, just to kind of get away, like, it's super fun and competitive. Gets my competitive side, and, um, yeah, but I have a good wife because I just hear people saying, you know, like, oh, my wife would kill me if I get a game like, like, Really? Like, your wife doesn't like you to have fun? So, shout outs to the wifey. Shout out to all the wifeys and the spouses that let their spouses be you. Just have fun. Shout out to the moms. Shout out to the moms and dads that bought Call of Duty Advanced Warfare for their kids. And if you haven't, tell them they can play with me. So, if your mom's not letting you just say, hey, Alejandra said, mom, dad, he wants to play with me. You're getting so. in trouble. <laughs> I know, I'm probably gonna get some parents like mad at me. What are you saying? What? Oh, secrets. I don't know what you're saying. Just say it, Tim. Mommy <laughs> pulled daddy's secret. Mommy pulled the camera. Oh. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, tell me a secret. And don't touch those books. Okay. Daddy's the most. What? Okay, tell me I won't say anything. Go ahead. I won't say anything. I won't say anything. Go ahead. I promise. I promise. I won't say anything. Thanks, babe. I heard her. We are putting the girls down to sleep, and Bella is begging me to sleep with her, but I will get knocked out in the middle of the night. So, no, thank you. Please, please, please. I know not tonight, please though, Mom. Okay. Maybe on Friday night, cause it'll be a sleepover and we'll sleep in. <gasps> no boys allowed. No boys. <laughs> no boys. No boys. No yeah. boys. Never. Never. When's that's that? for sure. Huh? When's that? When's what? When we're um sleeping with you. Oh. Friday, Mama. When's Friday? Three night? more nights. Three more nights. It's Tuesday, so we'll have to do tonight, Wednesday night, and Thursday. Is night. that Christmas? No. No. <laughs> what is that? I wish. Huh? It's what Christmas for Daddy. Just a couple. It's weeks. Christmas for Daddy though. Why? Call of Duty. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. No, it's Christmas for me and Sadie too. Why? Toys R Us. <laughs> oh yeah. And mommy. And oh. it's Christmas for me because I got you guys. Yay. Yay. You're right. Great. Yeah. Uh, um. <laughs> I know. I'll say something. What Yay. Is um. What is three more days? Friday night, mom, and then it's a weekend. We'll have a fun weekend together as a family, okay? Exciting. All right, let's uh, say our good night and then we'll do the prayer, okay? Can you guys sing the good night song for our friends? Good night, sleep tight, don't let the bed bugs bite. Good night. Good night, everyone. Let's pray. After dark, <laughs> when, the kids when the kids go down. Adult talk. I'm just kidding. Um, there was this show growing up. You gotta understand, I am the biggest R&B, like 90s R&B. I'm the biggest R&B fan. When, I used to, when we first got married, 
What are you That's saying? all you're I wanted king, to. You're the king of ad libs. He knows. I know not all, all the, words, the la- but yeah. All the I know all the, all the. I know all the. You know the ad libs um, that uh, Jodeci, Boys to Men, Shy, the little True to the next bridge. The ooh yeah, ooh yeah. <laughs> I suck at singing. So <laughs> that's what Jodeci used to do. If you think you're lonely now. Anyways, I suck at singing. That's not Jodeci. That's Jodeci. If you think you're lonely. Wait until tonight. It's a remake that's of a Bobby Womack song. Exactly. Growing up, me and my brother always used to listen to R&B, like Key Sweat, and all those best, 90s music was the best. Anyway, so uh, when I got married to Sarah, she did not like music, and so sometimes I'll try to like... I didn't like music. Um, when I go to bed. Terrified. When, when you go to bed. Asleep. Yeah, I need it so bad. So my girls take after me, they have to have to listen to music every single night. They listen to um, good music, so kid stuff and some um you know church stuff and so um uh, the reason that i can't is because i sing the song so then I'll, don't my sing brain control stays, yourself my brain stays awake and i'll be just like singing the song and I, my brain won't shut off she can't sleep anyway so i bet you if she tried it I know, I it would probably vampire. but i don't know i would like to bring it back do you guys like have like something that you do to go to bed like, is there something that you, like, is it a fan? I know some people need a fan on. Um, your mom needs a fan. Uh, I need to feel cool. Like, that's, I'm weird. But music is, like, I have to do it. I have to hold another pillow. I try to hold Sarah, but it's uncomfortable sometimes. Um, but I have to hold a pillow. Like, I have to hold it because it's, like, I can put it, you know, real snug next to me. And so, Nobody um, get snug next I, to me. I try it. She's like, hold me. And I hold her for, like, 37 seconds my and, arm uh, hurts i'm like ah my arm's uncomfortable <laughs> and yeah but um but anyway so uh music taylor swift's new album is it's good it's so good i know it's like every some people are like cheese fest usa but i really really like it not every single song but there's some pretty awesome songs yeah. in the album yeah i never liked her country stuff um, but you gotta, you gotta admit, we're talking, let me talk about hustle. This girl like writes all of her music. And so there's a lot of people out there that have like Iggy Azalea. I mean, I love her beats, but she has a ghostwriter. She has people that write a lot of her raps, especially when she first came out. And so I have a lot of respect for Taylor Swift because she writes her stuff. Was not a fan of her country. I hate country music. Sarah loves it. Like oh, we have this. Hey. Um, I'm a hater, I'm gonna hate, hey, hey, hey. She wrote that for you. Um, <laughs> because, no, she's not. Well, maybe she did. Uh, but this, this album is It's good. It's country. more pop. It's, it's more country. pop. I think if you listen to it, I'm a big fan of uh, Lord, And I, I feel like, and I know she's a fan of Lord too. Um, I think she really similar was influenced. Beats. Yeah, it's, it's similar. And so it's actually a really good album. She sold 1.27 million albums in a week. And that is crazy. So paid. she's getting paid. <laughs> um, she's doing something right. And you can't hate the hustle, man. You got to respect... The hustle. Hashtag respect the hustle. Tweet me that. Um, so so it's actually a good album. And uh, yeah. I'm sorry that the vlogs went up super late this yeah. week. It was crazy again at my mom's. Not being able to get the files from Alejandro. I tried and failed. The internet's so slow over there. Yeah. It was like as soon as I got home and downloaded the stuff. It was like in two minutes where it took me two hours at my mom's. And then it completely failed. So I was so bummed. But if you aren't our fan or you mm, don't like yeah. us on Facebook, make sure and do that because I'm we're gonna try to be more active on there. Yep. I've been just like posting the links right away as soon as they get posted to YouTube, to Facebook, just so you guys can click and have it there. But we're gonna just try to be more active and let you know like the vloggers going up in an hour or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Let us know if you guys like that or not, or if, yeah. that, if you want to reach out to us on Facebook too. Or just keep it on YouTube? Yeah, no, I would say, well, well a friend of ours, um, uh, Eddie G, OMG, he uh, posted our Jimmy Kimmel uh, thing, and it had like 10,000 views in 24 hours on Facebook. Because I know a lot of people, like you and I, um, you know, spend 30, 40 minutes a day on Facebook, whether that's mobily or whether that's on their, you know, at work or whatever. And so since you're already there, you're probably spending as much time on Facebook as YouTube. We're just going to have it at a, a, a multiple places, different, uh, way different way to get 
connected with us and so it's been working for Eddie and that's what we're gonna do uh, Eddie's actually uh, a part of the Me Too network as well I actually met him before he was a part of Me Too had no clue that he was a part of it just an awesome supportive guy and uh, yeah, kind of, you know, the Me Too stuff, I, we haven't noticed really any changes to anything. I don't know if I you guys have... a few of you guys have because the commercials are in oh, Spanish. Oh, in Spanish. And so I asked them, like, hey, what is... I'm waiting to hear back from them. You know, it's just an ad. Um, so not expecting everyone to, like, oh, my gosh, like, you know, probably not freaking out. You guys thought it was funny. You know, we just joined the network. We're going to start doing some more Facebook. In the comment section, do us a huge favor. Two things. One, let us know if you've liked or you already like uh, That Reyes Family on uh, Facebook.com forward slash That Reyes Family. Let us know if you've done that. We appreciate that. Um, and then two, what do you want to see more of? We want to be as interactive and connect more and just get some inspiration from you guys for sure. You know, do you want more Motivation Monday? Do you want more Q&A with us, with the girls, more marriage advice? Do you want some crazy dancing? We want to help you craft this show. So think of yourselves as almost directing this show with us. And so the two things is comment, are you liking us or can you, uh, did you just like us on Facebook.com forward slash that Reyes family, and uh, you know what do you want to see more of on this YouTube channel? Love you guys so much. Appreciate you so much. Anything else you want to say, baby? With a little bit of you and a little bit of us, we can change the world. Peace. <laughs> Pulled over on the side of the road because we couldn't handle it. It is way too pretty out here. There's a stream and there's trees. Get over here! Yelling. Everyone's running. 